points, lines, rays, segments, angles, triangles. A point is defined as a location in any space and is represented by a dot and does not have any length, height, shape, or size. It may be used as marks the beginning to draw any figure or shape and is labeled with capital letters. A point is maybe on the left. Or maybe on the right side. Or maybe on the top or above. Or maybe on the below. Or maybe on the center labeled as point A. A line is a straight one dimensional figure which has no thickness and extends in both directions. A line can be made up of several points connected together. We have here four points and connecting these, we can have a line with arrow on both sides and this is a line. We can extend this on both sides indefinitely. We can call this line AB. Or interchange is line BA with arrows above. A ray is a part of a line that has a fixed starting point but no end point. This is a line no starting point and no end points. From this line, we can have a ray with one starting point but no end point. We can have two intersecting rays that form an angle. An angle is the figure formed by two rays called the sides of the angle, sharing a common endpoint, called the vertex of the angle. These are the sides of the angle, ray AB and ray AC. And the intersection of these two rays is the vertex of the angle. Measuring the angle in counterclockwise direction, angle theta is positive angle theta is the universal symbol for angle but we can also use any letter in the alphabet, number or Greek letter. Measuring the angle in clockwise direction, angle theta is negative. Angles are measured in degrees or radians. A line segment is a part of a straight line that is bounded by two distinct end points. This is a line. And this is a segment with two end points. Three segments intersecting at the end points form a triangle. A triangle is a three-sided polygon. It is a geometric shape that has three sides and three angles. Triangles can be classified as, 1. Scalene triangle. A scalene triangle is a type of triangle in which all three sides have different lengths. It is the most general type of triangle, and there are no restrictions on the lengths of the sides. Because the sides of a scalene triangle have different lengths, the angles of a scalene triangle will also be different. This means that a scalene triangle is also an irregular triangle. Number 2. Equilateral triangle An equilateral triangle is a type of triangle in which all three sides are equal in length. It is called an equilateral triangle because it has three congruent sides. An equilateral triangle always has three angles of 60 degrees, and it is the only type of triangle in which all three angles are equal. Because all sides are equal, an equilateral triangle is also equiangular, meaning that all three angles are equal. An equilateral triangle has many interesting properties, and it is a well-known and important shape in geometry. It is a regular polygon, which means that all sides are equal and all angles are equal. It is also a symmetrical shape, meaning that it has lines of symmetry that divide it into congruent halves. Number 3. Isosceles triangles An isosceles triangle is a triangle in which two sides are of equal length. The two equal sides are called legs and the third side is called the base. The base is the side opposite the vertex that forms the two equal angles, called base angles. The two equal angles are called vertex angles. The point at which the two equal sides meet is called the vertex. Isosceles triangles are symmetrical, which means that if you were to fold the triangle in half along its base, the two halves would match perfectly. An isosceles triangle be an isosceles acute triangle is a triangle in which all three angles are less than 90 degrees and at least two of its angles are equal in measurement. Next is isosceles obtuse triangle. 
An isosceles obtuse triangle is a triangle in which one of the three angles is obtuse, lies between 90 degrees and 180 degrees, and the other two acute angles are equal in measurement. Next is the isosceles right triangle. An isosceles right triangle is defined as a right-angled triangle with an equal base and height which are also known as the legs of the triangle. The sum of the angles of a triangle is always equal to 180 degrees.